So now I thought I forgot to perform the sliding experiment so now I'm gonna perform it um, quickly and as you can see the laser from the diode that was really stable because you can see from here you can see the center is not really blinking and, and now I'm gonna use my hand to touch the table and you will be able to see the little a little bit change from that laser okay you might see that it's not really stable but now you see when it press on the table it's really really changing something uh, unlike the previous laser um, it won't change a lot when I'm pressing on it. And now I'm performing the sliding process. Because it's really, really sensitive to the light. I'm just moving my finger a little bit. You can see it's coming in and out very clearly so um, from what I observed today is that I think we really need a good laser because um, this dial laser is giving out a really good output and it makes things very stable so the next step I'm gonna move the whole setup to the table that's not floating and we will be able to see um, if the vibration from the table make any differences